Ooh, hey everybody, this is Nick, Indie Gamer News. Getting my ass kicked in Dungeon Souls today. I cannot get good at this game. I'm just not good at this game. Time for the wizard. Let's, let's see how this goes. Obviously, the first skill I want is that crazy explosion thing he gets, so... Seems like the fire rate's maybe faster now? Alright, well that's still obviously powerful as hell. Alright. I like that it's pretty much killing the, um... I missed you? I like that it's pretty much killing the... Dudes as well, what do you call them, the elites. That's good. Alright, and I guess we'll take duplicate, even though I... Does it still work the same way? It's better now. That's actually much better. Just being able to hit the, the button like that instead of clicking, but still, I think it's kind of weird. I think it should just, just be, like, the straight up just teleport. You know? I mean... Yeah, I, I still don't get the point. I think it should just be teleport with, um... 30% chance to hit for 999 damage. I feel like that 30% is a lie. Because when I was using the, um... The Thief, I should have definitely got more than more hits than I... More 30 percenters than I did, you know? I don't really care about that Potion of Rage. I don't think I want... I'll take, uh, Assassin's Blade, I guess. I should definitely be using this explosion more. I don't know how long I'm gonna be playing this game for. <laughs> I gotta tell ya. Uh, everyone's a little too squishy for my liking. You know, I play other roguelikes, it definitely lasts longer than this. Ow, you fucker. It's just because it doesn't seem to be any kind of template system. It's just kind of like fucking random as all hell. And just like the the constantly spawning monsters is a little silly. I don't know. Maybe I'm just a pussy, but um... I mean like, you know, this is area one right now. And I, I'm going balls to the walls to just survive. You know what I mean? Fucking constantly spawning shit? Like, give me a chance to fucking breathe. Can't even think to go and pick up these chests. Like, as soon as I clear somebody something out, something else fucking comes up. too hard, but, you know. But I'm gonna do a little bit of bitching, because god damn it, this has been a tough recording session today. Just aggravating. Let's give it another go, huh? Well, I guess I'll take what it was. This, the thief's book is that movement speed. I don't know. Either that or maybe the berserker ring. Uh, all of those are okay ish. Nothing for me, just a curse. Okay. 
feel like there has to be like more of a reward for killing the guys you really don't need to kill. You know, just like the random spawning dicks. Like, they should be dropping more keys and stuff like that, you know? I think this game has the potential to be really cool, but it's just like a little bit too hard and generally I never fucking say that shit. I love difficult games, but it's it's difficult to the point where it's like I don't think there's thought in the difficulty. It's just like throw this shit at you. Just throw endless fucking shit at you. You know what I mean? I don't know, maybe you don't know what I mean. Alright. Four out of five ain't bad. Like that trap just blocking the door? What's with that? That, that seems dumb as fuck, doesn't it? does to me. And I gotta get close enough to hit it, you know what I mean? Because my my accuracy with this guy is terrible. Because he shoots all over the place, so you gotta kinda get close to actually get the hit in there. Like this dude. You better drop me something good, but you're not gonna. You're just in my way. What is this? The Golden Hand. I couldn't read it because, you know, the, the shop isn't in its own spot. There's just shit spawning in here. Steal enemies gold each attack. Doesn't seem that good, but, well, I'll grab it. So I haven't had it yet. It's a rare item. I'm saying, I like this game, but I, I get some serious complaints. Like, I, 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 this looks like a game I could love, but I just... It just pisses me off too much. Just like, yeah, might as well just go back to Isaac or wait for Enter the Gungeon. So I guess this should make me super rich, hopefully, I don't know. Yeah, it looks like every single time you hit somebody, they lose gold. But he didn't, he had no, he didn't actually spawn any extra gold when he died. So I don't think it actually does give you extra, extra gold. It's just that it, like, leaks out of them. Oh, man, that's not good at all. I'm sad that I bought this. See, that should just be a teleport that stuns people. I, I I don't get the popping it in one spot and then using it. Doesn't make any sense to me whatsoever. You know what I mean? Alter your vision, it can be altered. That's what I'm saying to you creators of this game. See, if I want to stun everybody, I should just... Because, I mean, that's that's why you use that. What, what, what other point is there to using that, other than the stun? So, it's like, you get out of the way... What do you think? It's just too easy if, if it's just made to stun? And teleport? I don't know. Setting it up is, like, annoying. It just everything in this game is so Twitch focused that it seems like that that ability is, like, dumb. Alright, well, you're dead. I had to use every single potion. 
potion, potion. What's this one? 90% chance for attack to explode. Critical hits. Pickaxe. Plus two damage. Plus five critical chance. That's a nice one. <laughs> Got an okay-ish amount of money. So I guess I'll set that up. Before I start. Wow, got a lot of, uh, a lot of potions right there. Uh, I'll take the cat's paw. Give me the XP, whatever. That's about all I can stand. Thanks a lot for watching. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you want to see some more stuff in the future, and I'll uh, talk to you later. Bye.